This is the Outdoor Revolution Airedale 7SE. This long-standing model in the Airedale range has been improved for this current season uh, by adding a air tube to the side annex. Previously this was a steel pole, now this is an inflatable tube, making this entire tent fully inflatable. There's also a, another improvement to the uh, front porch ground sheet, where previously it was a bathtub ground sheet, now it's a Velcro on flat ground sheet, which really does kind of create the feel of a sewn-in ground sheet, but also give you the option to remove that, should you wish. It's constructed from a premium 240 HDE polyester fabric, which has got a high strength to weight ratio, so despite the size of the tent, the pack size is really manageable. It's also got all the premium features you expect, such as storm straps, the lifetime warranty on the tube, and plenty of mesh ventilation inside. Let's go and take a look. Inside the tent, you can already feel the temperature difference compared to outside the tent. It's a lot cooler in here, and that's due to the lounge liner, which we've got in place. Uh, this is your, normally an optional extra uh, with the Outdoor Revolution tents, but with this particular model, it does come included. Uh, what's, what the lounge liner does is create a thermal barrier between the inside and outside, so it helps to moderate the temperature inside the tent. Also, it helps to reduce condensation. Uh, as you can see, the living space is vast. It's a really wide tent anyway, and deep. Um, with this two-thirds rollback internal divider door, once rolled back, it really does help to incorporate the front porch. Um, and with the new fold Velcro flat ground sheet, um, it just feels like a continuous flow of living space. Um, that ground sheet, like I said, can be removed, should you wish, but once it's in place, it really does feel like a sewn-in ground sheet. You can further extend your living space by adding a optional zip-on front porch extension. Uh, you can also add the Airedale side extension. Um, but the tent as it is, like I say, is huge. You can see the nice deep bedroom pods here div uh, divided by zip-in dividers, which can be zipped out to make larger rooms, should you wish. You've also got the side annex, which is built in. Uh, it's shown here with an optional bedroom in a tent. It doesn't come with that standard, but if you are, are wanting to have people sleep in here, you can buy this as an optional extra. There is a door outside to exit the tent, so in theory that could be someone's own kind of private uh, camping <laughs> space to enter and exit the tent without coming through the main body of the tent. Lots of mesh ventilation, like I mentioned, there's mesh panels on either side of the divider panel here. Uh, there's a large mesh panel on the uh, side door. There is also lower level me mesh ventilation as well as rear ventilation, so lots of airflow through. Uh, you've also got the premium features you'd expect from Outdoor Revolution air tents, such as the Velcro for the uplighters, Velcro points for attaching the LumiLink kit, and tube uh, toggle points for the Oxygen tube pockets, shown here. Um, finally, there is an option to add a further bedroom space by toggling a two berth inner into the central area of this, therefore creating essentially 11 sleeping uh, spaces by not really compromising a living space.